The university is encouraging students to stay home after spring break, but students are going to come back to, to campus for a variety of reasons. John Dooley, Vice President for Student Life, is here to share some, some thoughts and some, some advice for those students that are coming back to campus. Yeah, we know that um, one of the things that we've been trying to tell students is we are definitely open, um, and if you need a place to go, we will be that place. Um, but as students are away on the break, we've encouraged them certainly to be mindful of prevention um, practices that they can undertake, to practice social distancing um, over the break, um, and to be really thoughtful about their return. Um, and so we've tried to give them some good advice um, electronically and, and to let us know if they've got any questions along the way. And with that social distancing in mind, the university has canceled events of 50 or more people. Um, and that's uh, something that should be applied not just for sort of these official um, events at the university, but social instances too, is that right? Yeah, I think as you look at this, it's very clear that um, this virus has been a significant disruption um, to our way of life and to what we've been accustomed to. And um, that will be through formal things like events and activities that we might normally expect to happen, right. um, but also through the everyday practices that you, that you uh, engage. And so, you know, one of the things that I've tried to tell students is if you're coming back um, from the break and you think you're going to be hanging out with friends and partying and those kinds of things, um, this virus is really calling for us to think differently about the way um, we live our lives and the way we engage. So I hope students will be thoughtful and mindful um, as they come back. And we've seen this has been a very rapidly evolving situation. It's not going to be the same uh, experience coming back to campus after spring break, is it? Yeah, I mean, obviously we're used to in-person engaged learning on a residential campus. And so the shift to having online classes for a couple weeks after we get back will, will feel different for folks. Um, it will be a different flow and, and set of expectations. But I think, you know, one of the other messages is that this is still academic work and your academic uh, progress needs to be your priority. And so we hope students, wherever they are, uh, will engage seriously with their faculty members on the academic work that they have this semester. Great. Thanks so much for that good input. Thanks.